If you don't know guys, this is the DAX robot trading software and the functionality of this program is actually quite simple. And again, the whole point of this application is to simplify the trading experience for beginner traders without any prior trading experience. So in essence, even if you've never traded before, DAX Robot is represented as a tool that you can use to immediately join and start making money through the global markets. And the way it actually works is quite simple. You have 10 different robots that you can choose from within the top 10 robot list within the application. So all you have to do is select a robot from the list, initiate the run button to actually activate that robot. And from there, that robot that you've selected will start trading for you and place trades into your connected broker. Now, a couple things that you should understand about DAX Robot is that this, of course, is a Forex, uh, excuse me, a Forex trading application. And this can be pretty ideal because as many of you may know, Forex CFD trading can be very complicated, especially when you're dealing with pip spreads, stop loss, and take profit values. So with DAX Robot, you're using an application that analyzes markets for you and trades for you on your behalf. So it makes things a lot easier, especially for the people who've never traded before. Now we are going to do some live trading as I mentioned earlier, and what I always recommend doing before you trade is check the economic calendar. Now, as you can see, guys, as of right now, it is a little after 6.30 in the morning my time. It is very early, and for those of you who are wondering when is the best time to trade with DAX Robot, um, and what's great about this, guys, is that the answer is whenever you want, whenever it is convenient for you. I have personally tested DAX Robot early in the morning during the day and late at night with great results, but personally, I like to trade early in the morning due to the fact that I have a busy schedule and other things that I have to take care of. So when you are using the economic calendar, in this case, investin.com, what you want to look out for, guys, is avoid trading during any type of high volatile market conditions. And when in accordance to investin.com, these events are labeled with three bulls. So ultimately, double check the economic calendar. Make sure that as you're about to trade, that you're not trading during any type of high volatile market conditions. But again, guys, since it is only a little after 630 in the morning, my time there's really nothing that we have to be too concerned about. So for more information on that, guys, if you have questions about the economic calendar, how to use it, how to read it, feel free to drop a comment and I'll be more than happy to further explain. Now, going back to Dax Robot, guys, a couple other things that you should know. Um, first off, more concrete information about the program itself. It is recommended that you visit their official website. Dax Robot is actually configured with only one robot, which is Dax Base. Hence, it's called the Dax Robot. So if if you actually wanted to sign up and become a member, this is where you visit their page and you go down here to the broker section where, as you can see, the only broker choice is DAX Pay. So you click this little button here for the select broker. You make the minimum deposit of $250. And once you do that, your DAX robot application will be activated so you can proceed to trade. So again, very simple, guys. I will leave the link down below in our video description for your convenience. And again, if you have any questions on that, feel free to drop a comment. Now, without further ado, guys, let's proceed and let's play some trades. Now, like I said, we're going to do some trades and then we're going to review those trades once everything closes so that way we can judge the results. And we're actually going to do this in two different ways. We're going to review the results in our broker, but we're also going to review the results in the trading history of the application. And there are some great benefits of doing this with Index Robot, which I will further explain as we get to the results later in this video, right? But first off, let's start selecting robots. And of course, again, there are 10 different robots to choose from. And one of the most common questions I get, guys, is, you know, what are the best robots to choose from, even with a small minimum deposit of $250? So I'm going to initiate some trades here with the robots that I use the most during most of my trading sessions. But also keep in mind guys that these robots are very well maintained they are they are all configured with their own strategies and indicators in order to calculate markets for us and of course place trades with the optimal results so we're actually going to first start with the rsi ma cross so we initiate the robot and then we click the run button now we're going to do uh, hp cycles we'll click run on that we're going to do the bali band bounce click run on that um, I think we'll also do X profit, click run, and I think we'll do one more, guys. Um, let's do the strong ADX, all right, and we'll click run.
So with every robot that you select, you will actually get a visual right here under the My Robot list that will show you all of the robots that are currently active that will trade for you. Now, within a few moments, we should receive some notification um, of trades that are initiated by the robots that we've just selected. So we just got to give it a few moments for these robots to, of course, analyze markets and place these trades in our broker. But in the meantime, guys, another thing I also want to share with you is that in addition to the 10 robots that you have, within DAX Robot, you also have the option of creating your own robot as well. Now, we do have notifications of trades have been initiated, guys. So um, let's actually first, before we get into the create my own robot topic, let's quickly go here to our broker and confirm... Um, okay, so we have three positions already. So again, very simple, guys. What we're doing is selecting robots to trade for us. And as you can see, we already have three different trading positions. So um, we did select five robots, so we are waiting for more positions. Uh, so let's give it a few moments. But going back to the topic of creating your own robot, uh, we actually covered a very similar topic about creating robots um, with the other application called BIMBOT Pro. And that is where we posted this video, which the same principles of creating a, a robot within BIMBOT Pro are pretty similar or identical to creating robots within DAX Robots. So I will leave a link to that video down below in the video description, even though that it even though it pertains to a different but very similar program. But we are going to. Oh, and perfect. Look, we got confirmation for more trades. So, um, but we are going to create a robot specifically within Dex Robot. So if that is something of interest for you guys, drop a comment. But again, I will leave a link to our other video for creating robots down in the video description. So now we have confirmation, guys, of these trades, as you can see within our broker. Um, we do have a couple of double positions here, so that should be some interesting turnouts. So let's go back to Dex Robot. And what we're going to do now, guys, is simply turn off the robots by simply clicking the stop button um, as you can see here guys so and now we have visual confirmation that none of the robots are active anymore and the reason why we do this is of course because we want to prevent over trading we already have uh four five six seven eight nine ten trades okay so we already have ten trades guys so we want to you know uh, we want to prevent over trading, so that's why I stopped those uh, stopped those robots. Now, keep in mind, guys, that with Dax Robot, Dax Robot initiates a um, you know couple more couple trades at a time. Um, this, of course, is a little different to other programs that we are normally accustomed to. So again, that is why it's important to be mindful of the notifications of the trades that you receive, and that way you can keep track of the trades that you have. All right. So at this point, guys, all we have to do is wait for these trades to close. Very simple. Um, and when it comes to using DAX robot, um, it could take as little as maybe a few minutes, half hour, 15 minutes, maybe an hour or more. So what we're going to do, guys, is simply pause this video. And then in a few moments, we will return within DAX robot and DAX base. So that way we can confirm the results of our trades within our broker and the trade histories within the DAX robot application. All right, guys, so stay tuned. We'll be right back. All right, everybody, we are back. The time is up. So we're going to go back into the DAX robot so we can review the results of those trades. And hopefully, guys, by this junction of our video, you have a better understanding as to how DAX robot works. Remember, guys, this is an auto trading program which is designed to work for you. And they provide you with automated robots that are configured with different strategies and indicators to target different assets. So again, this software is designed for beginners to make the trading experience a little bit easier. But of course, the best way to judge performance of a software like DAX Robot is, of course, by judging the results that it can generate. So we're going to review and confirm the results through two different methods. We're first going to judge with our broker, and then we're also going to review the results in the trading history. And again, there is a benefit to doing it in this method, which we will go over as we reach this point. But first, if we go here to DAX Base, um, again, we did a total of, well, technically the robots that we selected did a total of 10 trades. Now, as you can see here, guys, we have great performance um, out of the 10 trades. We only lost two of them. So we are looking at an 80% win to loss ratio, which of course is fantastic. So as a result, we are looking at a total equivalent profit of $5,136.52. Now, a very common question that I do want to clarify is how does Dax Robot initiate trade values for the trades that it chooses for you and the fact is guys is that DAX robot initiates about 10% of your total balance 
Now, given the fact that we have, uh, well, when we started this session, we uh, had a little over 50, what was it, like 57,000. So 10% of that is what's initiated for your trade. So even if you have a small account of $250 or $500, Dax Robot will initiate 10% of that value into your trade. So I hope that made sense. If you have questions on that, feel free to drop a comment. So not bad, guys. Making, you know, $5,136. Uh, $5, Great results. 80% went to loss ratio with only two losing and trades now what what's really cool about this is that if we go here to the trading histories um, there's a great benefit to doing this, guys. Um, yes, you do have confirmation of the trades. We can confirm um, the wins. We had a, a double loss for the GBP USD, so we lost over twenty-six hundred dollars from those two trades. But again, we are able to compensate for that losing trade for those losing trades with the eight winning trades. But a great benefit to looking at the results within the Dax Robot application is that it actually gives you information as to which robots were used for this designated signal. And by doing this, guys, you can actually keep track of which robots are performing best for you. So I hope you enjoyed this update, guys. I hope you found it helpful. Um, again, Dax Robot's been around for a very long time. It's one that I've only been using for, I would say, a few months, but it's been around for almost two years. So um, it's definitely a great application if you are a beginner trying to get involved in Forex trading. Look into it. Um, I will leave all the information down below in the video description for your convenience. And if you have